Welcome to our show. Our show is called Top City Travelers. In the show, two boys explore the top city, which you all know as Topeka, Kansas. To start you off today, we have a segment called Metropolitan Walk, which some say started a new era of entertainment at our school. Personally, I think it's the worst of the bunch. Oh, I didn't see you there. Let's go. I can't keep my hands steady. As you can see, this bad boy is one of my favorite pieces of modern architecture. It's ancient of Newton. Whoa, don't hit me, train. It's not real. As you can see, this bad boy is one of my favorite trash cans in the entire city. You just throw it in there and it's gone. I'm the trash man. <laughs> the Office, that's my favorite show. <laughs> this is the middle of the show. On to the next bit. Excuse me, sir, do you know how to get to the weather room? He's just shy. Now this is one of the great fruits of Metropolitan Walk. We got Thagus Plasticus. Let me just stick it in my pot. Wait. We gotta leave no trace so the next person can see this beauty. Surely this was a success. As you can see, there's a lot of places you can walk in Topeka. Ain't it a view, beautiful city? Oh, I was just admiring some of this fine art. You know, speaking of art, Topeka has a really great art display at the Middle Arts District. So the boys went and checked it out. I can't keep my hands steady. Rat neck, rat neck, stro, rat neck, stroten, rat neck, stroten. Frump towers, more like tilted towers. Am I right, boys? You see a lot of stuff tagged with the toe everywhere. It's everywhere. I'm pretty sure it's a gang thing, but I don't know. But like, you know any information? You could always tell them like I'm a good explorer. Why, hello to you too, Topeka. Growl. You know, the only other place I've, That's a pretty good Don't looking sack. Oh, hey, uh, just making sure their windows are tight. You know, there's a lot of places to explore in Topeka. A lot more than you think, anyway. Oh, didn't see you there. You know, here in Topeka, we're proud to be the home of the governor. So, the boys went and checked out the governor's trail. Let's go. What's up, guys? It's Elias here, and today we're gonna be dropping on the governor's mansion. <laughs> You know, a lot of people say there aren't many places to explore in Topeka, which is why Chase and I have set out to explore as many locations as possible this semester. Oh no, we lost our duct tape. Can you find the duct tape? Muy bien, good job. Hey girl. You know what type of dating app a tree uses? <laughs> Timber. Yeah, so I was talking to this fine orange tree, right? And then I told her this great joke, and she was like, I don't find you appealing. 
Did you hear that? No, you didn't. Because when a tree falls and no one's around, there is no sound to be heard. I think it's the hat. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. Hi, my name's Elias Mosher, and I used to not be able to do parkour. You see, I got so tired because I had a lack of vitamins. But with the help of salad, I've got all the vitamins I need. I can just nozzle this stuff down. Mmm, delish. And now I have all the vitamins to do all this great parkour. Every year, 15 Americans die due to icicle attacks. This holiday season, get your STDs. Stand away from it. Tell others. Whoa, Chase, watch out! Whoa! And destroy ice. Make sure you're protected. Hi. My name's Elias Mosher, and as many of you know, I love parkour. So much so that I've been trying to spread the knowledge of vitamins to everyone. But recently, I've hit a wall in my parkour experience. That was until I started training under a furry master, the goat. And today I'm here to introduce to all of you the power of the goat. The goats also make sure everyone hears them when they're about to do their parkour by bang. But instead, I do Every day they do many laps and run a whole bunch up and down stairs. You know, they also have the magical technique of the random jump. Sometimes they'll be standing somewhere and just jump and it's crazy. The goats also use masterful techniques of nibbling on random objects. It's actually pretty good. to your regularly scheduled program. Oh, what am I doing? Well, I'm just practicing my golf swing because I'm so excited for this next segment. It's called Business Bogey, and it takes golf to a whole new level. <laughs> Vikes. You know, a lot of people say you can't explore a lot of places in Topeka. So Chase and I have decided to go to Sports Center and play some putt putt. Let's go. Four. Hole in one. Don't tell Dealing Dardo. Still can't see at the end. Bye, Vikes. Today we visited the Sports Center and we sure had a blast. See you next year, I guess. Hi Vikes, today we're coming back for a special winter themed episode. 
with all the snow around, we thought we could go explore in the snow. Come along. Choo choo. Oh God, God, get it, get out of the way. Oh. Uh. Don't worry, it's not real. Jameson, why are we taking on water? Captain, there's a whale. Oh God, a whale, abandoned ship, abandoned, abandoned ship. Why hello to you too, Topeka. Growl. <laughs> and as you can see, we have the tracks of the Scroggle Donkus right here. Now if we follow them, we may be able to find them. Did you hear that? Okay, me neither. See that it keeps going. The Scroggle Donkus likes to hide its tracks. Oh my god, there's more tracks over here. The Scroggle Donkus must be hiding. Did you hear that? Yeah, me neither. As you can see, the Scroggle Donkus likes to hide its tracks. It tries very hard. Oh my god, look, there's even more tracks now. We must be on the tail of this Scroggle Donkus. I can hear it nearby. We gotta find him. He could be the last of his species. There's more. He keeps multiplying. I'm gonna beat him this time. Ah, I'm parched. What? But I'm thirsty. I got one. <laughs> I'm still thirsty. Ah, you know, this is my type of exploration. A nice rain. Ah, you got the fog all messed up. There we go. So this is actually how an igloo works. You see, on the outside it's all cold and gross, but on the inside it's a tropical rainforest. Ah, hello, my gentlemen. Uh, do you have any Fruit Loops for me? Uh, oh, okay, I, I'm sorry, dude. I, I, didn't, I didn't mean to offend you. Uh, I, I, my bad, my bad. Uh, no, uh... Ah, oh, P.U. Ah, oh, man, this is why you don't get skunks. They smell so nasty. Brother, I have come to free you, but I forgot the file. One day I will free you. I will free you all. Oh my god, he's drowning! No! Oh, he's fine now. Yo, girl. You want me to warm up that cold heart of yours? Oh, sorry, dude. Uh, I didn't mean that. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, no offense, man. No offense. Ah, otters are my favorite. Look at them go. <laughs> yeah. Oh, they're so cute. <laughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Oh, wow. I hope you put up with our stupidity and had some fun along the way. But if you didn't, I'm truly sorry.